What's going on guys? Today we're going to be talking about how you use World Edit in Minecraft Bedrock 360. I oh know, not 360. Xbox One Edition. Bedrock. So, we're first going to start off by building like a, a terrain area of what, that's what the World Edit is going to be built out of. It's going to be, uh, I would recommend making it a circular shape just for certain cases where you need circles um we're gonna start off by get, doing slash give at p command block so we're gonna type space command block underscore it has to be an underscore block as you can see it gave us a command block right here so now we're gonna use this we're gonna Put it here and space them apart then we're gonna have to put it on repeat both of these go on repeat we're gonna scroll down till we get a repeater or a comparator we're gonna put the comparator down in between the two command blocks like this We're then going to want to go and get some redstone block. We don't need it quite yet, but this is for later cases. It'll go right here, like so. Break the command block for now. So we're going to start off with our first command. Oh, wait, actually, we need, uh, we need a diamond axe first as well. I prefer to use a diamond axe. You guys can use any of these tools. Now we're going to start with our first command. You're going to want to type slash, slash enchant, I'll make it bigger, enchant, at P, efficiency 3 is what you're going to need. And what that'll do is that will enchant your axe or whatever you need. You just as long as it's not a trident. So you don't need that redstone yet. Um we're gonna need to keep enchanting or we're gonna need to enchant the efficiency. We're then gonna need to put the other command is going to have to be We're going to need the corners, the coordinates of, you could use any block, but you're going to want to put coordinates of this corner, the low, where the redstone is, you're going to want that corner, and then you're going to need the exact, uh, so this one is 872 is mine, so I'm going to write that down somewhere, 872. I'm gonna write this down and then we're gonna fly over to the other corner to the exact opposite you're gonna need the layer there and layer there then we're gonna go to the other corner corner and we're gonna place another redstone and stand on top of the redstone 13 12 and 7 so once we have these written down, we're going to want to come back over here. We're going to type in execute. Let me full screen it for you guys in a second. Hang on. Execute. At P. Then we're going to do uh, like a bracket. M equals C for creative mode, comma tag equals brush. And you'll see why it says brush later. We're going to do, and then we're going to put that in brackets. Then we're going to go three arrows, spaces in between all of them, 10 
clone, a space clone. And then you're going to do space and then put your first coordinate of this one right here and your last coordinate of that one. You're going to so you're going to want to do my first one was 8 I believe. Hang on. Yeah. 8 7 2 like that. 13 12 7 like this then you're going to want to put squiggly line negative 3 squiggly line negative 2 squiggly line negative 3 and then after that you're going to want to put masked normal like so and you click enter. Okay. Says syntax error unexpected. Just ignore it. There is nothing wrong with it as of right now. So we're just going to ignore that. Yeah. Okay. Now that this is set up. We can, I believe we can now place down, uh, yeah, we can, oh, okay, so we're going to have to give, we're going to have to do slash tag at P space at P. At S space add brush, which will then allow yourself to get the brush that we entered into this command block. We're going to put our block down. We don't need that on. And see where it says the target does not hold an item. So we're then going to hold our item. We now have the ability to world edit, but as you see, it may be getting spammed up on the screen. So we're going to go slash game rule. We're going to want to type game rule. Then we're going to type at oh no, no, no. we're going to type game rule space Command block output. Then we're going to put space false. Now, whenever you uh, do world edit, it's not going to. We have redstone. Hang on a second. I'm going to delete the redstone. So you can delete the redstone and change it at any time. So now, if I delete all this redstone. We now could put world, we can now use world edit wherever, whenever, however we want the mountain to look. I'm just going to make mine like a really weird shape. And if you want to stop using world edit, you just scroll up. Sorry for the voice crack. And that'll do it for today's video, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe. Don't miss out on any content by clicking the bell. And see you later.